Hey everybody, I took you out to a wind farm today for this video because we're going to be talking about the world's biggest wind turbine, the GE Halliad X. It's just a few miles from where I grew up. I really wanted to see it in person and I wanted to give you a reference point for how tall these are compared to the Halliad X. So this wind turbine that you see right here from the base to the rotor is 311 feet. And when the blades are in the complete upright position, they reach 410 feet. So 410 feet is pretty tall, but these pale in comparison to the Halliad X, which is a whopping 853 feet, twice as tall as the wind turbine that you're looking at right now. It's bigger than an 80 story building, only 14 stories less than the One World Trade Center in New York City. One Halliad X turbine can crank out 74 gigawatt hours of energy per year. That's the same energy output as 148,000 Corvette Z06s or a whopping 8 billion, 140 million LED light bulbs. The blades move at a blazing 262 feet per second. The full rotation of the blades of the Halliad X creates a 38,000 meter squared swept area, which is as big as seven football fields. It has a crazy 722 foot rotor and it cranks out a massive 12 megawatts of energy, which is 60 to 64% capacity factor over the industry standard. So just to give you a sense of how powerful the Halliad X is, just one rotation of the blades like that is enough energy to provide a house with all of its energy needs for two full days from just one rotation. One Halliad X is the equivalent of taking 11,000 cars off of the road each year. Now you're not gonna find the Halliad X in a field like this or out in California or something like that. It's gonna be offshore. They're gonna be in the ocean because of just how huge they are. There's a 190 Halliad X farm being built off of the shore of the UK that's gonna provide enough energy for six million homes every single year from just 190 of these things. I gotta say, I think I might be a, a wind guy. I think I'm a wind man. Time to stare off like this at the sunset to convey a greater meaning about renewable energy and wind turbines. By the way, this thing, it's the sun. It's not causing climate change. We're causing climate change. Just stop with that whole, I don't know. 